Hello friends, Chris Light here to let you in on some of the coolest features in XSplit, Player.me and Challenge that will help your streams be better than ever. First up is XSplit Broadcaster. One of the ways to increase the production quality of your stream is to use Stinger Transitions. If you don't have the resources to create your own custom Stinger Transitions, you can actually use the Stinger Creator with GIFs. To create a Stinger with a GIF, change the file extension from .gif to .mov. You may need to adjust the file folder settings in Windows to adjust the file extensions. When adding the GIF, now a MOV, as a stinger, you'll have to guess the transition point or length of the stinger on how long the GIF is. Click Convert and test out your new transition. Sticking with transitions a bit, an often overlooked feature is the favorite transition system. If you're running an esports production, favoriting various transitions and stingers allows you to access these transitions by right-clicking on scenes rather than using the drop-down menu. XSplit Broadcaster's Presentation Packager makes it easy to transport your streaming configurations between various PCs. The Presentation Packager extension packages all your images and video files along with your presentations into a zip file. Save this on a thumb drive and you'll be ready to go. Combine this with XSplit saving streaming settings in the cloud and you'll be able to broadcast on a new PC in minutes. If you're a fan of the Elgato Stream Deck, you'll be happy to use Exploit Broadcaster with the device. We've worked closely with Elgato to offer a wide variety of controls for the Stream Deck. In addition to standard scene switching and stream controls, you can also toggle sources and mute unmute audio sources. Another little known feature is the adaptive bitrate function. Everyone experiences bandwidth fluctuations while streaming and it can be hard to adjust bitrate settings on the fly while in game and restarting the stream can lead to a loss of viewers. Enabling adaptive bitrate removes this frustration as the adaptive bitrate will automatically adjust to your available bandwidth and keep your stream live and lag free. Enabling adaptive bitrate is easy. Just go to your extra encoding settings for video. Aside from software features, being an XSplit user offers additional benefits as well. We also offer 24 seven support on our website. We've also launched our XSplit Elite program, which offers an affiliate program that allows you to earn some extra cash on the side, among other benefits. Next up is Player.me, which we are developing into the ultimate tool set for content creators. Player.me Create offers hundreds of overlays that can be customized with various widgets for tip alerts, subscriber trains, labels, and more. You can also connect your Streamlabs account to display tips as well. All the overlays are saved in the cloud and work in conjunction with XSplit to automatically adjust your game and webcam sources. You can also create your own custom overlays with an easy to use web based editor as well. Player.me offers a dashboard to review streaming events and tracking of live stats. Last but not least, Challenge is the easiest and quickest way to set up tournament brackets. Simply drop in some names and you can get a bracket started. You can also host prediction competitions for brackets and vote on the matches. If you paste your challenge bracket URL into XSplit, you can also display your bracket on stream as well with some cool customization functions. Thanks for taking a look at Split Media Lab's family of products. We definitely would love to hear feedback about what features you need and be sure to reach out to us on social media if you have any questions about our products.